All right, everyone, so I'm gonna cut a quick one today. Feel free to uh, like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and share this video as much as you can. So we're gonna go over some reasons why you've stopped growing, okay? Number one, you're not eating enough food. Uh, I would say a good 85% of the time when I get a new client that comes to me and they're having problems growing more muscle tissue, it's usually that they're not eating enough food and getting enough nutrients and macros. So that's number one. Number two, um, not enough rest days, believe it or not. Um, you know, I'll have new clients come to me and they will be on like, you know, like a six day in a row training split instead of like a two on one off or a three on one off. Usually a three on one off does the body good. Make sure you're taking about two rest days a week in order to ensure optimal recovery and growth. Number three, um, I would definitely say that uh, not getting enough sleep is a big one. Six to eight hours a night is what you need to really optimally grow. You can get less and still grow, but to optimally grow six to eight hours of sleep a night. Number four, not changing um, you know, your exercises here and there. Um, you know, you want to give the, stick the same exercises in there for the you know, first like four to six weeks, but after that, you need to start changing some of the exercises up, hitting the muscles at different angles, changes the rep ranges, etc. You can't go in the gym and do the same thing every time and expect to get excellent results. Uh, the next one would be, the final one would be, uh, you know, if you're an enhanced athlete, is your gear real? Did you test your gear? Have you actually lab, been having your gear lab tested or tested with a home testing kit? That's a big one. So if you're not, if you don't have real gear, then how is it possible for you to continue to grow? And the last one, training intensity. Are you actually training with intensity each and every time you go into the gym? Make sure you're tracking your progress with a progress tracker, like on your phone, some type of log that will uh, help you measure your progress each and every time you go to the gym. Uh, the Strong app is a good one for your cell phone. You can use that app in order to track your poundages and the amounts of weight you're moving every set, along with the sets, the amounts of sets and reps that you did on that exercise during your last workout. So make sure you're doing all these things in order to continue growing muscle. And once again, go ahead and like this video, subscribe to my YouTube page, and share this video. I hope you guys have an awesome day. I'm out of here.